Hello backers, this is another video to answer some uh, frequently asked questions that we've been getting. Uh, one question that's been asked is what's the difference between a carbon fiber and a Kevlar? Like what's the advantages and disadvantages of each? Um, they're about the same thickness. Um, and they, I believe the Kevlar does seem a little bit more flexible. Um, you can see how carbon fiber just has that sound that just seems to snap right back into place and the Kevlar just, I mean it still has it but it's a little bit different. I mean, so they're both springy, they both spring back into place, but the carbon fiber, um, just by nature of the material, is a little, uh, a little stiffer, a little more brittle. Um, so if, I mean, it's close, but I mean, flexibility would have to go with the Kevlar. Um, again, about, they're about the same thickness, about the same finish. Um, that's the only advantage I can see is that the Kevlar um, is a little bit less brittle, so it's a little bit more flexible. Um, another question asked is, do they shuffle? Um, and yes, I've been working with uh, this carbon fiber deck for a couple of years now, ever since I got my first prototype. And oops, you can tell that um, they are a lot stiffer than a regular playing card deck. I mean, I'm putting a lot of force to get them to bend that far. Um, but it still gives you the ability to um, shuffle them. Um, that second part, that riffle back, is a little bit harder to do. Um, so yes, they're a little bit stiffer than paper. Um, obviously paper cards uh, bend a lot easier and not as durable. Um, and then here's the uh, the Kevlar. A uh, group of, a bunch of samples I've got here. I don't have a full deck printed yet. And they do uh, riffle a little bit better back. Um, I know there are other different types of shuffles out there. Um, this is the one that I know the best. So um, there you have it. Carbon fiber playing cards and Kevlar playing cards can shuffle.